Wow. Yeah, good evening, everybody. Great to see so many people out tonight. This is great. And I've been on it. I, what I love about this, uh, this event tonight, more than anything else, I get to say hi, neighbors, because uh, this is home for me. I, uh, I, we, we lived here, well, when we, we lived in, this, in the North County for about uh, 45 years now. And our first 26 years or so, we're here in San Marcos. My wife always remembers when we uh, pulled into San Marcos for the first time, and there was no Highway 78 back then, there was just uh, Mission. And uh, we, we went uh, through the city limit and, and it said population 14,000. <laughs> and I think today we're, we're bumping up to 100,000, if, uh, if not more than that. Uh, we live now over in Vista and uh, we just absolutely love the North County and can't think of any place we, we'd rather live. I, I, I was thinking about when, when we were, I was thinking about coming over here, we lived, if my directions are right, we probably lived about a mile and a half that way, okay? And um, we remember, I remember uh, before this was here, I, and this will be interesting to see if anybody here remembers this, this used to be the location for the Red Barn, okay? And this was, this was the community center, and now it's out on Twin Oaks out there. And I remember before the college was built over there, it was the Pro Parave Ranch. I don't know how many of you remember that? And so we were, we were, our house sat between the uh, Hollandia Dairy and the Pro Parave Egg Ranch. So depending on which way the wind was blowing, we got some really unique odors uh, on, a, on a regular basis, but uh, it was okay. It was, it was a wonderful place to raise our kids. Uh, they went through all of their uh, elementary and high school years in the San Marcos system. And, Right, and our daughter actually graduated from Cal State San Marcos. So tonight I'm going to kind of talk about a variety of different things. I'm going to go through a lot of things kind of quick. Ordinarily when I do these workshops, we do about six workshops a year uh, with San Diego County Credit Union at their corporate offices. We kind of always have a specific subject. But I thought for tonight it would be kind of good to maybe just touch on a lot of things and then leave plenty of time for uh, questions and answers. I have to be out of the room by 7.30 because I have to carry out what I consider today my most important duty, uh, and that's to pick up my granddaughter. Okay, so uh, uh, that's really important. She's 11 years old, she's at uh, volleyball practice, and I have to pick her up tonight, so I can't be late for that. Uh, grandkids are great, aren't they? For those of you that have grandkids, you know. Uh, you know my grandparents and grandchildren get along so well? They have a common enemy. True, isn't it? You know what I'm talking about. So, uh, so uh, I'll talk a little bit more about, about that's Sophia, but and we have three other grandkids that you know we're, we don't get to see as often. They live up in the Seattle area, but we we we, uh, we use Southwest Airlines quite a bit and uh, get up there to see them quite often. So uh, I want to go through just a couple of things that I think. Oh, and by the way, I want to. I really just want to thank, obviously, the sponsors for this uh, event tonight, uh, uh, San Diego County Credit Union. I'm a, a great fan of San Diego County. People are clapping for San Diego County Credit Union. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and for the uh, county library system. Uh, this is uh, spectacular. I do a lot of workshops for a, a group called uh, Oasis. I don't know how many of you know Oasis, but it's an organization for people over the age of 50, and it's all about lifelong learning. I'm very proud of the organization. I've been doing workshops and classes for them for over 20 years. And uh, at one of the classes, they brought up something very important that I did not know. I, I always, I talk about invest, investments and, and how to get good information and how to make decisions, and we'll touch on that a little bit. And one of the resources I always recommend to people is a, is a, a service called Morningstar. It's an independent service, a subscription service online or in print. And, uh, and somebody mentioned at a class not too long ago that said, you know, if you have a, a San Diego County Library card, you can go online and have access to Morningstar. It's one of the services that's available to members of the, of the library, people who are card-carrying members of the library. I'm going, you're kidding. And so I went on and I found out that's the case, and so I'm getting my library card next week, and I'm going to be using it to uh, access all kinds of information, but in particular, uh, Morningstar. Look forward to that. 